When I was in university, Cuando estaba en la universidad, my grandfather was diagnosed with cancer. Mi abuelo fue diagnosticado con cáncer. And he was always very peaceful. Y él siempre estaba muy pacífico. Very loving. Muy amoroso. And he was a, he was a big man. Era un hombre grandote. He enjoyed eating. Un gran hombre le encantaba uh, comer. But when he was diagnosed with cancer, Pero cuando lo diagnosticaron con cáncer, uh, he was taken to the hospital, se quedó un tiempo en el hospital, and he started to lose a lot of weight. Y comenzó a perder mucho peso. And he got to be so skinny, y comenzó, llegó a estar tan flaco, tan delgado, that he was kind of like a skeleton with a little bit of skin. Que era como un on. esqueleto con un poquito de piel encima. And he, I went to see him. Uh, with my father. Y fue, fui a verlo una vez con mi papá. And my father said he had tried to kill himself in the hospital. Y mi abuelo dijo que trató de suicidarse en el hospital. Because he was in so much pain. Porque tenía tanto dolor. In the advanced stages of cancer. En un estado tan avanzado de cáncer. And so I went to see him. Y entonces fui a verlo. And they had him strapped like an animal. amarrado como si fuera un animal. Strapped in bed. Amarrado a la cama. He couldn't even move. No se podía siquiera mover. I guess because he had tried to kill himself. Supongo que era porque había tratado de suicidarse. Strapped him in there. Que lo amarraron ahí. And he was angry. Y estaba muy enojado. And he had quit talking. Y había renunciado a hablar. He wasn't speaking anymore. No hablaba But ni I could nomás. see in his eyes he Pero was he was angry. Ver en sus ojos que estaba muy enojado. And so I got on one side of him and my dad got entonces, on the other side of him. Entonces yo me puse en un lado de él y mi papá se puso del otro lado. And and he started looking at me. Y comenzó a mirarme a mí. And I tell he's communicating with me. Y comenzó a comunicarse conmigo. And then he was using his eyes because he refused to speak. Y estaba usando sus ojos, se rehusaba a hablar. And so he kept looking at me and then he'd look at the straps. Seguía viéndome a mí amarrado me, con las cintas. Straps, me, straps. Me a las cintas, a mí a las cintas. So I just said to my dad, I'm taking papá, the straps off. Le voy a quitar las cintas, las voy a desamarrar. And my dad said, you know, I don't know what the, the doctors are. Y mi papá dijo, we're in a hospital. Oye, pero estamos en un hospital, ¿qué van a decir los doctores? No sabemos. I said, I don't care. Y yo dije, no me importa. He, he does not want to be strapped Él down. no quiere estar amarrado. And if these are his last hours, y si estas son sus últimas horas, I don't want to see him strapped down like an animal. Yo no quiero verlo amarrado como un animal. I'm taking the straps off. Le voy a quitar las cintas por completo. So I started taking the straps. My dad helped me. He said, okay. Mi papá ya entonces me empezó a ayudar. Vamos a desamarrarlo. And he got a, a look of relief immediately. Y tenía una cara, un, un semblante de, de alivio inmediatamente. And he started to move, maybe move his body for the first time. Comenzó a moverse un poquito, como por primera and vez. And he moved around, moved around. Se movía un he poco, un lado al otro, cada vez calm. más suave en su gesto, más and calmado. And then he looked at me. Y entonces me miró. And he smiled. Y me sonrió. He still wasn't speaking, but he smiled at me. Dice, no quería hablar aún, pero me sonreía. It was my grandpa. And he, Era mi abuelo. he said, y dijo, he said, pull me up, boys. He spoke. Y dijo, Por favor, he, said, jálenme, chicos, he spoke to me and my father. Pull me up, boys. Throw me around the room. Levántenme oh, y, y llévenme. He always had such a sense of humor. Y siempre tenía tanto buen sentido del humor. And so I helped his back move. I helped him get up. And, oh, he was so full of relief. Y se lo sentía tan aliviado. Set him back down. Then I pull me up again, boys. So he nos dijo, just por favor, move, jálenme otra vez. Simplemente se quería mover un poquito. This went on for a little while. Seguimos así por un rato. And then an announcement came over the speakers. Y entonces escuchamos un anuncio hospital. en unos altavoces. Visiting hours are over. Las horas de visitas están acabando. All non-medical personnel must leave the no hospital. Del hospital. So I had to hug him and kiss him. Abracé. And I felt this is probably the last time I'll see him. Y sentí que posiblemente iba a ser la última vez que lo vería. And as I left the room, y cuando me fui del cuarto, I looked back. Miré atrás. And they were strapping him up again. Y lo estaban amarrando otra vez. And I got to see his face. Y pude ver su cara. And I could see on his face y podía ver that en he su was cara very upset. Que estaba muy molesto, muy enojado. So I went home. 
Y entonces fui a casa. And I prayed. Y oré. And I said, God, y dije, Dios. If you had anything to do si tienes algo que ver, algo que hacer. With what I just perceived. Con lo que acabo de percibir. I want nothing to do with you. No quiero tener nada nothing. que ver contigo, absolutamente nada. I said to God, I won't even have lunch with you. Le dije a Dios, ni siquiera voy a comer contigo. <laughs> And God spoke to me. Y Dios me habló. And he said, oh, my dijo, beloved, oh, my my beloved amado, child. Mi hijo amado. I had nothing to do. Yo no tengo nada que ver. With what you just perceived. Con lo que acabas de percibir. But you need help. Pero necesitas ayuda. You need a lot of help. Necesitas mucha ayuda. And I'm here to help you. Y estoy aquí para ayudarte. But you have to be willing. Pero tienes que estar dispuesto, tener voluntad. 